brief, a very brief example of what we mean right here. We want to show you this program that we have. Um, let's play it. Let's 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 play it for you. It is predominantly. Let's see, wind it. Okay, you see the title? Why is Satanism? In this predominantly Catholic nation. The devil is gaining a foothold. There is a greater openness toward the devil. In fact, Rome has been called the most Satanized city in Italy. Satanism and the occult are in fashion. There are an estimated 800 satanic cults operating in this country, with more than 600,000 followers. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Hold on for a moment. You see, with, if there's that many cults operating with that many followers, therefore, our theories concerning what this whole Amanda Knox case means is both right and exact. The whole program, we're going to upload it so ones and ones can check it out for themselves. You understand? But this is just one, one example right here of what we mean when we're talking about. I'll go away. The devil's diabolical influence is growing in so many areas of our society. He needs to be driven out. Leading the battle to drive the devil out of Italy is 82-year-old father Gabriel Amor. <laughs> now that right there, you know, <laughs> can Satan, Satan drive out Satan? That is the question. That is the question indeed. So, uh, stay tuned. There's there, there, there's more. There's more to come. Yahweh and Shalom. Rastafari.